This retirement home is the best place to trick or treat! They're too old to remember you've already been there, so they keep giving you candy! Nice to meet you! Happy Halloween! Bob, this is Congress. Yeah, our politicians are old, but hasn't it always been that way? Age and experience go hand in hand. That's true, but the thing is, our current Congress is the oldest in history. And if you want older politicians, they need to be in that sweet spot where they've gathered wisdom, but aren't experiencing cognitive decline yet. Nice to meet you. Happy Halloween. McConnell is 81, Joe Biden is 80, Nancy Pelosi is 83, Feinstein was 90. <gasps> Never reveal a beautiful woman's age! Now, I wouldn't advocate for age limits, but something does have to be done when many politicians are at best too old to understand the problems faced by young people, and at worst, making decisions past the point of senility. Nice to meet you! Happy Halloween! Well, it's a good thing we're balancing that out by electing more young people. The Senate's the oldest it's ever been, sure, but the House has been getting younger. But here's the thing. Electing a 30-year-old who doesn't know anything isn't going to put us in a better position. Age plays a role here, but a far more important factor is confidence. And our overreaction to a geriatric aristocracy could leave us with a bunch of inexperienced know-nothings. Which isn't where we want to be either. The American population is aging. For both the voter base and general population, median and average ages have been going up, so it shouldn't be too shocking that our politicians are also getting older. But at some point, we have to put our foot down and acknowledge that certain people are long past the point where they can competently navigate exercising government authority. Nice to meet you! Happy Halloween! Long past the point! Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe for more educational cartoons. We drop one every two weeks. Boy, oh boy, do we love doing it. So you subscribe so we can continue. Thank you.